Hey guys, it's MGS again with another Pokemon Showdown battle, a random one against T. Trollio. He leads off with Duck Stocks. I have hit Mon Lee. I go right for the Blaze Kick. I know it's super effective. He goes for Sludge Bomb. Unfortunately, he gets the poison on Hit Mon Lee. So that's going to severely shorten his stay on the field. So he switches to his Vaporeon because he knows it could take a Blaze Kick. It's not very effective. But I do have the close combat and a fighting gem, so I know that's going to one-hit KO Vaporeon. So that's very convenient for me to get that out of the way right off the bat. So he sends his Dust Stocks back out. And I go for Blaze Kick to finish it off. So I'm off to a good start. Hitmonlee already knocked out two of his Pokemon. So here's his Dust Clops. Probably should have switched that in instead of Dust, dust Stocks. Um, he set up a substitute, which is annoying. So I go for Blaze Kick. That doesn't even break his sub because Dusclops has high defense. As his Seismic Toss does KO my Hitmonlee. So I send out Munchlax. And uh, lucky for me, he misses the Will O Wisp. And I got off a Whirlwind. That's what I was trying to do because. I wanted to get rid of that um, dust clops for the time being. So Rufflet went for Brave Bird and I got off a of Ice Punch. Doesn't one hit KO. That what really um, upset me there. Because this Rufflet is going to be super annoying to me throughout this battle. I rest up from the damage taken by Brave Bird. And he does the same, but he uses Roost to recover damage. I go for Sleep Talk, but unfortunately it randomly chose Rest instead of Whirlwind or Ice Punch. So he goes for another Brave Bird, and that's um, that dealt heavy damage. So um, this time I did get the Whirlwind from the Sleep Talk, but that brought in his Darkrai. And I'm not too thrilled to see a legendary like Darkrai on his team. But I'm going to have to try to handle that. Uh, his Darkrai set up a sub. I went for another rest. And I knew it. I kind of had a feeling it had Focus Blast, but I wanted to try to stay in to see if I could take on this Darkrai. So, um, lucky for me, um, Sleep Talk chose Ice Punch, broking, uh, breaking the sub of Darkrai. So I send out Excel Gore because it resists Focus Blast. And Bug Buzz is going to be a one-hit KO on Dark Rhyme. That's very nice to take out a major threat on his team. So he sends out the Rufflet again. Unfortunately, the Hidden Power Electric does not finish the Rufflet. Or it could have been Hidden Power Eyes. I couldn't remember which one. So uh, I made a fail mistake here, thinking that he's going to attack me. I went for Sucker Punch to try to finish it off, but... He read that perfectly and just roosted up, so I just went for the Dark Pulse, and it doesn't finish Rufflet, and he went for the Rock Slide that one hit KO'd the Houndoom. So I send out my Floatzel, and I think he, had, he knew I was going for the Aqua Jet, so he brought up Palkia to resist that. And unfortunately he does have a second Legendary on his team, that's going to make it even more difficult to defeat him. So he went for Spatial Rend, and that did half... Uh, damage to Floatzel. I went for Crunch. Doesn't do as much as I hoped. His Draco Meteor destroyed my Floatzel. So I'm now down to two Pokemon. I send out my Munchlax again. It's still sleeping. Palkia goes for the Outrage. Munchlax survives that. Unfortunately, Sleep Talk chose Rest. So I can't use Ice Punch or Whirlwind. And another Outrage. Munchlax is so sturdy and bulky, it lived two outrages. So this is my last chance to... I was going to say, um, you sleep talk, but he's going to get another outrage off before I could do anything. So, uh, at least it's confused from the three outrages, so that forces him to switch to a rufflet as I bring out my last Pokemon, which is Charizard. I set up a sub thinking that he had to switch, so that was a smart play by me, but unfortunately I missed the air slash on the rufflet. And the rock slide 
demolishes the substitute. But then finally air slash hits. And that was really lucky there. If I missed another air slash, this battle would have already been over. But um, Charizard keeps on going here. I miss Fire Blast. That allows Dusclops to get a substitute. And that is annoying. Uh, air Slash does hit, and with a crit to break the sub, uh, as Dusclops got a seismic toss. I go for Fire Blast, that did a lot of damage, and Dusclops survived, gets off another seismic toss. And here's another Fire Blast to finish off Dusclops. So my Charizard comeback is looking pretty good, and now it's time for him to take it all the way by defeating this Palkia. I use Air Slash. Luckily, I got the flinch, so uh, Palkia is unable to make its move this turn. So I get to attack again with another Air Slash. Unfortunately, I don't get another flinch, which was out what I was hoping for. But luckily, uh, Charizard survived Draco Meteor, allowing me to finish off Palkia and get the amazing and epic Charizard comeback. So thank you all for watching my random um, battle on Pokemon Showdown with T. Trollio. Comment, like, sub. See you guys in the next Showdown battle.